Hello and welcome back. This is Greg French. Uh, today we're going to talk about ICS security, cyber warfare, and Stuxnet. Uh, ICS security, this is industrial control systems, uh, primarily run through Siemens software, and there are some other vendors. Uh, Siemens happens to be probably the world's largest, and uh, their software is everywhere. Uh, programmable logic control units are units that control industrial devices. Uh, these devices might uh, be found in water treatment plants, power grids, refineries, uh, nuclear power plants, traffic signals, almost everywhere. And again, they're all controlled by Simon Software primarily. Uh, Shodan. Shodan is a website uh, that's free. Uh, you can go to it, you can do searches, you can find thousands of unsecured devices all over the globe. Uh, these devices are devices that have uh, face, facing uh, internet, so you can, you can access these through, uh, through the internet, and most of them have unsecured uh, passwords or default passwords. Uh, it's amazing, these would include uh, maybe Cisco routers, uh, other industrial devices uh, that can actually be accessed and controlled from the internet uh, since they're unsecured. Uh, this is creating quite a concern uh, within the industrial community, especially since uh, Stuxnet uh, was released. Stuxnet was a worm virus uh, 30 times more complex than anything ever found before. Uh, had over 20 zero-day vulnerabilities. These are Windows vulnerabilities that have not yet been detected or reported. Uh, targeted payload. The, the device uh, was created as a cyber weapon and targeted uh, to the Iranian uh, centrifuges or nuclear power program. Uh, incredible device. Uh, it's available on the Internet today. Uh, people are dissecting it and trying to reintroduce re-engineer it and uh, possibly redeploy it. Uh, where is it going to end up? It's anybody's guess. What's next? Well, I'm involved in a cyber patriot program. Uh, this is where we're trying to train kids to become new cyber warriors. Uh, China's been doing this for about 10 years. Uh, the United States has only been doing it for a couple of years. It's a national competition uh, for high school kids, uh, training them to be able to uh, detect problems and protect uh, our national resources. It's a great program uh, sponsored by the U.S. Air Force and also Northrop Grumman. I'll be developing uh, additional uh, security curriculum uh, primarily targeted for the high school kids for the Cyber Patriot program but the things I'll be uh, covering uh, apply to all our computer resources. Well thank you very much for your time. See you next time.